Stretching from central Mexico to modern-day Honduras, the Mayan civilization lasted for over 3,000 years. Throughout that time, the Maya culture formed, dissolved, and reformed into what archaeologists have classified into three eras. The Pre-Classic, Classic, and Post-Classic Era. The Maya mastered agriculture, developed writing and languages, made creative and functional pottery, excelled in the understanding of calendar making and mathematics, and left behind an astonishing amount of impressive architecture and symbolic artwork. Cities were linked by roads that allowed for easy transport of goods and people all around the empire. Cities had plazas, palaces, temples, and pyramids, as well as courts for playing the Maya ball game called Ulama. The court at Chichen Itza is one of the best preserved to this day. The Maya were deeply religious and worshipped various gods related to nature, including the gods of the sun, the moon, rain, and corn. At the top of Maya society were the kings, or Kuhul Aja, who claimed to be related to gods and followed a hereditary succession. They were thought to serve as mediators between the gods and people on earth and performed the elaborate religious ceremonies and rituals so important to the Maya culture. But by 900 AD, most of the stone cities were abandoned. This dramatic decline has long puzzled archaeologists. One common myth is that the Maya disappeared entirely. This is not true. With each collapse, a new period of recovery followed. What can be said with certainty is that there is no universally accepted theory to explain this collapse. Theories range from overpopulation, foreign invasion, peasant revolt, and the collapse of key trade routes. Other theories include environmental disaster, epidemic level disease, and climate change. There is evidence that the Maya population exceeded capacity of the environment, including exhaustion of agricultural potential and overhunting of large animals. Whatever the reason, when the Spanish made first contact in 1519, they were astounded by what they saw. Large pyramids, gold, precious stones, and new crops like cocoa. It took the Spanish until 1697 to subjugate the Yucatan Peninsula. During that time, countless treasures were stolen and shipped back to Spain. Uncountable numbers of people were forced to slavery and indigenous religion and worship was forbidden with mass conversions to the Catholic faith. Yet the Maya peoples never disappeared, neither at the time of the classic period decline nor with the arrival of the Spanish conquistadors and the subsequent Spanish colonization of the Americas. Today, the Maya and their descendants form sizable populations throughout the Maya area and maintain a distinctive set of traditions and beliefs that are the result of the merger of pre-Columbian and post-conquest ideas and cultures. Many Mayan languages continue to be spoken as primary languages even today. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, please hit that like button and consider subscribing.